Today we're going to be solving a math problem. We're going to find the vertex and the axis of symmetry of g of x equals x squared plus x plus 3. First, we're going to find our h point, which will be in our vertex. To do so, we're going to use this formula here, which is h equals opposite b over 2a. We'll plug in our numbers. h equals negative 1, which comes from our b term, over 2 times a, which is 1. And that equals negative 1 half equals h. We can put that over here for our vertex as our h term. Now, to find k, we're going to have to plug in negative one-half as our x. So we'll do that now. And then we'll go through our order of operations. Negative one-half squared is one-quarter plus negative one-half plus three. We'll simplify. We end up with two and three quarters. And we'll put that in over here as k, two and three quarters, and our vertex is in the form of interval notation, which is one negative one half and two and three quarters for our vertex. Our axis of symmetry will be x equals negative one half. And that is how you find the vertex and the axis of symmetry.